This TLX is the most premium and advanced Acura sedan we've ever made. And we wouldn't be delivering on precision crafted performance if we also weren't elevating vehicle safety. We're delivering Acura Watch as standard equipment, including features new to TLX. On the passive safety front, our latest ACE body structure addresses a broader range of real-world collision scenarios, including oblique angle frontal collisions. I am a technical leader in the crashworthiness group here within the safety department. When we think about safety for everyone, I think this is where we get tied in, right? We do a ton of work here to optimize that restraint system and making sure it's the safest we can provide to our customers. The new TLX will be the first model in our lineup to apply our all new next generation passenger front airbag technology. This next gen airbag is a true world's first technology and it was developed here in America by our own safety engineering experts in Ohio. Most airbags from a top view are shaped like a V. This one is actually inverted from that and that's fundamentally what's different between this airbag and a majority of airbags that are in the field. This unique solution consists of an airbag that has three chambers. The center chamber is actually offset from the two outboard chambers. Connecting the two outboard chambers is a sail panel. And what's unique is behind the sail panel is actually what we call uninflated volume, meaning that volume doesn't have to be inflated by the pressure of the inflator. When we can use this uninflated volume, we can actually bring the restraining surface closer to the occupant, and we can begin that energy management much earlier in the event, resulting in lower probability of injuries. We hope that most customers never have to see the technology that we put into the car, but the reality is it happens. We're there, we're protecting you. It's almost like the hands of the engineers kind of embracing those people during that crash is kind of how I think about our restraining development.